Yo, what's going on, guys? I'm C. Death Strider, and welcome back to another episode of Pixelmon Life. Now, today isn't really a normal episode, as you can see by the minutes. Well, this is this isn't gonna be really an actual episode, quote unquote. It's just gonna be normal. It's just gonna be a pranking episode, cause today we are gonna be pranking Dizzle. So if you're excited for a prank, then make sure you hit that like button down below and subscribe to my channel if you're new. And yeah, let's just do it. Also, I'm gonna t be telling you what I caught on. Oh, really? Does it really have to rain when I start recording? So yeah, I'm gonna tell you what I have caught up with. So my Feraligator is level 52. My Pupitar is level 45, and then my Skarmory is level 40, and then as you can see, my I gained, I got a new Ghastly, and now I have a Hunter at level 43. I just need to wait for Dizzo to get on, and then I can trade that into a Ghastly. And then a new, the newest member to the team, Houndoom! Yes, that is right. I caught myself a Houndour and evolved into a Houndoom, and this looks sick. So yeah, we now have a Houndoom and stuff, and as and I actually before when I logged on, a, a legendary spawned in the water. I couldn't find it, find it, and then I had to re-log, and then a legend, and then a Groudon spawned, but I accidentally killed it while trying to catch it. So yeah, so today we're going to be pranking Dizzo, and also, so yeah, this is going to be my team for now on. I mean, the Skarmory is probably not going to be, but later I might. I might get, um, I might get, um, a, I'm gonna get a Mareep, at, so I can get an Ampharos. So, we're gonna have an electric type on our team, and it's gonna be super powerful, because I'm pretty sure, um, Ampharos is one of the best electric types, I think. So, yeah, that's gonna be really good if we get him. Also, so, you're probably wondering what the prank is. Well, first of all, let me see if this actually does anything to the crops. What the? Oh yeah, let me see if this actually does anything to the crops. I don't think it actually does. Let me just kind of ploop. Wait, ploop. No, it doesn't do anything to the crops. All right. Well, today. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna do a funny prank. See, so I'm going to destroy his apricorn trees. But don't worry, it's all right. I already gathered them off camera. Like I've already gathered all of his apricorns off camera. They're, and don't worry, I've gathered them all. They're all fully grown. But yeah, I'm gonna destroy his apricorn trees and think, and he's gonna be thinking like, oh my gosh, my apricorn trees are gone. But I'm just gonna shove them in his furnaces. So he's gonna be like, oh my gosh, where are they, where are they? And then I'm just gonna put them all in his furnaces and it's gonna be hilarious. And then I'm also planning on flooding his base with water so to know not to me not to mess with the aqua dudes. Because the aqua dudes can strike hard. Because I got some serious pranks on my sleeves. So yeah, if you're excited, are you? So yeah, that's pretty much what we're gonna do. But don't worry, guys. This is all fun. This is all for fun. It's nothing serious. Like I said before, I've already gathered all the. I've already gathered all the apricorns. Like this is not. This is just fun. It's that. It's not like being serious. It's just a prank, bro. So yeah. All right. Let's. All right. Just gather la the last of these apricorn trees. Alright, just got a few more to go. And then we'll be done with this, and then I'll just shove it in all these apricorns in his furnace. And then I'm going to put like some signs down saying, you got raided by the aqua dudes or something like that. Okay, that's all the things down. And also, I'm not sure if I'm going to edit this video. I don't think I am, because I kind of want to post this. But yeah, alright. So I'm uh Shove some in here. Oops! Those get cooking, don't they? Whoopsies. I'll give them a bit of coal from my home. I forgot these start cooking. Uh, that's gonna be a problem then. Okay, yeah, that's gonna be a problem. Um. Oh, boy. 
That's going to be a problem. Actually, no, it won't. Because I have a lot of wood. Okay. Hold up. Let me go deposit. Actually, should I? No, nah, let me go deposit some stuff back at my base. So, and then we could just like travel back to his base and just flood it and stuff. It's gonna be fun. It's gonna be fun. I can't wait to see his reaction to when he records it or it, to when he what he does. Um, before, on Discord, I'm gonna tell him to start recording before he logs on. So he, he's gonna be so surprised of what I did. All right. Yeah, this is gonna be sick. Of course, though, if he comes on, that's gonna ruin the whole thing. And also, look at he over here. I got myself an automatic anvil, which are automatically making me pokeball lids and stuff like that. Alright, so I'm gonna just put a bunch of stuff in here. Oh, wait, no. What the? Oh, yeah! I forgot! It. The ant, the friggin' hopper drained some stuff. Alright, I'm uh. Okay, that, 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 that don't work. Okay, I think I got all the acorns. All right. Then what I'm gonna need to do is craft another chest. Uh, so I don't know, just kind of spam click these a little bit. And then I need to craft a ch a double chest. <clears throat> all right, double chest. There you go. Now let me go back to his base. I I, I think what I'm gonna do is put it. Put the chest underneath the sun. Snowball, what are you doing? Ice beam. No. Alright, so yeah, I'm gonna put the sign underneath. I mean, I'm gonna put the chest underneath the sign. So, oh my gosh, this is gonna be amazing. Alright, there you go. And then try to get the sign. Alright, let's do this. And then we're also gonna flood his base. So, but we've already taken down all the apricorns, so, uh, apricorns, apricorns, and then we're gonna just flood his base afterwards, and it's gonna be awesome. Hold up, let me ride my Skarmory instead. Skarmory, let's go! Cause I'm lazy, so I'm just gonna fly over to his house. Or should I put the chest on top of his house? Actually, nah, I'll put the... Actually, yeah, I think I should do it on top of his house. Yeah. Let me do it right here. So, I'm going uh, to put the chest down over here. And then put all of his apricorns in here. There you go. Tucked away. And now I'm going to do this. And then be like... And then I'm going to put this over here. I'll put a sign right here. Wait, no, actually, no. I'm not going to do that. Instead, I have a better idea. I'm going to put some wood planks like like this. Wait, hold up. Is there a way to get into his base without the doorway? Yeah, there is. Okay, so you can go in through this way. Okay. I'm going to do this right here. Block it off. I'm going to block this off real quick and say... Don't mess, don't mess with the, the aqua, wait, the aqua dudes. Don't mess with the aqua dudes, there you go. Don't mess with the aqua dudes, let's do this, alright. Good prank, good prank. Alright, now we can just flood his house now. Oh, wait, I'm going to put his torches in a chest, because I forgot he has torches. You know, I'll be nice, too, and give him my torches, some all my torches. I only have, like, two or something, but still. I'm going to just safely tuck his torches in there. Dang, he's got, he has a lot of aluminum. All right, now I'm going to go out this. All right, now let's let the party begin. Spread the water! Woo! Oh, this is going to be so annoying for him to clean up. Oh, this is going to be beautiful. This is going to be absolutely beautiful. Oh my gosh, this is going to be amazing. Flooding his house. 
And stealing all of his apricorn for putting him back. Ooh. And then I'm a I'm a flood is put some water right there. And now it's gonna be really hard for him to like get into his base and try to clean up the water because there's gonna be like because the water current is just gonna be pushing him everywhere. And there's gonna be like chests and stuff blocking his way. It's gonna be amazing. Wait, I need food. It's gonna be amazing. All right, let's eat some steak. Ooh. Oh my gosh, this is this is gonna be priceless. All right, put some more water down there to make it even more annoying for him to clean up. Oh my gosh, this is awesome. Wait, I think I might make an infinite water source like near. His oh my gosh, I can't even get out here. Yeah, I think I'm gonna make an infinite water source near his house so I don't have to keep going back here. All right, get one bucket and go over here. This is, oh my gosh, this is the best. All right, yeah, I'm gonna put the infinite water source right next to his house. So that way I can just go, go on. Deet. All right, there you go. Oh my gosh, the look on his face. He's gonna be so surprised, like, what the heck did you do? <laughs> oh my gosh, this prank is gonna be awesome. Flooding his house and stealing his apricorns and thinking he doesn't have them anymore. Bet. Alright, this, this is gonna be good. Alright. Let's put it, let's put another one right there. Right next to his chests. Alright. Now let's stick out, grab one. And then go back inside. Place another one. How about in the middle of the room, like right there? Oh, this is gonna be annoying to clean up. This is gonna be so annoying. And then place another one right there. I won't place too much because one, I don't want this video to be too long, and two, I don't want him to have to having to be clean up like this everything. So I'm just gonna place a few water spouts everywhere. Alright, yeah, I think I'm gonna place one more down and then I'm gonna, and then that should do the trick. And then do it right, wait, do it right there. There you go, right over all the stuff. Wait, no, that's not going down, what? Why's that not going down? Okay, there it is, right over his stuff. Wait, hold up, that's still not going down. Do it like that. Oh my gosh, it's still work. You know what? I'm gonna just kinda do it right there. Right near the entrance. And then I'm gonna do a little and then I'm gonna put some water outside here. <laughs> oh my gosh, so it's gonna be hard to enter. Oh my gosh, this is hilarious. This is beautiful. And then the masterpiece, you just you just do that. And then there you go. That way there's like friggin' oh my gosh, this is this is beautiful. This is amazing. And then over here we got the don't mess with the aqua dudes. Oh my gosh, this is amazing. And then right here, I'ma just put it so like there's I'ma put like I'ma put it so there's like wood everywhere in here. So it's just gonna be like, oh my gosh, real. <laughs> and, he, and then I'm gonna have a sign here saying like, nope, and nope. <laughs> oh my gosh. So yeah, there, his base is flooded with no apricorns, and then the, his furnace area is covered with wood. All right, I think that I call that a success of a prank. 